Hello dear all, today we are going to discuss about the deep learning model to detect the tree in high resolution satellite imagery. Uh, so this one is the tab that is uh, the description of tree detection using a uh, deep learning models. Uh, these are the description, these are the license agreements and uh, so on. You can use all these input band uh, uh, bit, uh, 8 bit, 3 band high resolution 10 to 25 centimeter imagery uh so this is it will be work on this resolution so the next one are uh, other type of the data are available these are the samples for this model how this model is looked like and how detect uh, how detection looks like so now we are going to perform this type of the detection using our chess pro 3 for this purpose you have to install a few libraries uh, as well as uh, uh, the first you need to go on uh, this link I will be share all these links in the description of the video you can easily assess so my uh, I have uh, you just click on this link and uh, download the library according to your RJS Pro uh, version if you have uh, 3.03 3.02 to this one this one 2.9 2.8 2.7 and uh, these are all libraries so you just click on the library and it is goes to be a start downloading so you can see that i already downloaded this library this one is rjs pro 3 deep learning uh, it is downloaded in a raw file you just need to extract it you can simply click on uh, here and click on extract file it is extracted after the session you can open the folder and there is a setup you can run this setup and it is automatically installed and integrated with RJS Pro 3. Okay, after this, uh, you have to download. Okay, after this, you have to download. Uh, uh, open this website. I will be share. I will be share the link of this website in the description of the video. You have to type here deep learning package. Uh, you can see is that building footprint extractions all these packages are available three point classification so you have to download uh, this one for this purpose you can scroll down and uh, here is the option for the tree detection okay this one is the tree detection you can click here the new tab is open this like this you just click on download version it will be a download and uh, you can see that it is uh, downloaded here after uh, the download of this folder uh, I will show you just wait a minute okay this file is downloaded tree detection dot di dlpk so this file is downloaded okay this one is your deep learning model after this you have to open uh, uh, you, you need our imagery for this purpose you use uh, USGIS here you I am choosing this location you just click here the point is marked and the next one is you need to go to data set and there is aerial imagery high resolution or throw imagery then click on result button it will give you the result you just click on the download button and uh, it gives you the option download you click here your imagery is downloaded you can see that I already downloaded so this one my imagery you can open this folder then there is a two folder you have to open vault 002 folder and this is the imagery you can simply click here and drag into your RJS Pro okay this one is my imagery okay the next step is that you want to create a simple you go to the catalog then click here then create a new then here is an option create a future class type here is a name area of interest then also type here then click on a finish button okay your area of interest is created here you can change its symbology by double clicking here and this one is your symbology tab here uh, you can uh, click on apply button then click on create future 
then you have to create the area of interest let's suppose my area of interest is uh, start from here okay this is my area of interest you just click on this button save edits yes okay the next step is that you need to go to your processing and uh, search the tool name here did detect object hit the enter button you can see that detect object using a deep learning here you need to input your raster image this one is a raster image this one is your output file you can also rename it according to your data here you need to import the model that is the this one this model tree detection model that is the downloaded so here you need to import this model here if you did not install the libraries properly so the model is not imported here i'm talking about the these libraries that is uh, i will show this one arcgis pro deep learning libraries uh, and this setup tool must have to install this setup after installing this setup you can uh, you can able to import the deep learning libraries so uh, the next one is about your processing the model is imported here these are the values you can see is that the next one is environment here you just need to add your area of interest then what is the cell size you can check its cell size uh, from here go to the properties then there is an option uh, source and the roster information this one is a cell size this is a 0.3 you can copy it and again go here and paste here your cell size 0.3 the next one is change its type processor type is gpcu to prompt cpu then cell size then area of extent is defining here as ai then uh, the, the final one is just you click on our one button it takes a uh, time so you don't need to worry about it after the completion it you i will show you how it display so you don't need to change these values so these are the default values remember that okay the object detection a learning is completed you just need to click here you can see that your uh, trees are detected here and the next step is you change the symbology just click here no color and outline as red then apply and see that these are the three are detected here these are completely detected trees so in this way this model is working so you just need to click here go to the attribute table and uh, the total number of trees under observations are 109 so the next step is that if you want to convert these into the another you just search a tool name as a polygon polygon to point okay this one is the feature to point here you need to input the layer this one and this one is your output layer. this all polygon is converted into the point okay go here and uh, you need to uncheck this one You can change the shapes from here 
and click on apply button to see the shape is changed. So I'm going to import type here tree. Simply you can choose a tree that are exiting in this area. Let's suppose I'm going to choose uh, this one and close the tab. And then you can see all the trees that are exiting in your area of interest. We go zoom to here. You must have to adjust the size. Go to the properties and uh, there is an option. This one is the height width and the size. You have to type here just that. So you can see that your trees are appearing here and this is your imagery and in this way you can detect all the trees uh, in your area that are you that is your other observation. Let's suppose these are the trees along the road all are marked. Thank you so much all of them.